Hi, I'm Genevieve Zawada. I'm the CEO of Elect Club. I'm a trainer for the Matchmaking Institute and I'm a writer and author for Guru and Go in London. I'm delighted to be telling you all about first dates and what you can do to be successful on a first date. So let's start at the very beginning. It's all about preparation. First and foremost, you need to be nice and relaxed and you need to look good and feel good. So let's start by getting ready. Make sure you have enough time to get ready. That's really, really key because if you don't have enough time and you're rushed and you arrive late, you're all flustered, it's gonna be a disaster. So first and foremost, give yourself plenty of time. Don't go straight from work if you can help it. Go home, have a shower, get changed, put something comfortable on, something that you feel good, you feel confident, and you know you, you look, you know, you look your best in. Make sure that you brush your teeth. I know it sounds really stupid, but oral hygiene is key, especially if you're after a first kiss. So make sure your teeth look good, you don't have anything stuck in them, and you smell nice. You know, people go on their senses, so make sure you smell good as well. But don't overdo the perfume. I've had many people over the years tell me that people have been overpowering with perfume and also, guys, you know, it's a little bit of aftershave, not everywhere, just a little bit, just to sort of tease the ladies with your nice smell. So guys, you get just as nervous as the girls do. Just be prepared for that when you both meet each other for the first time, that you're going to be a little bit nervous. One thing I always say is speak to each other beforehand. Pick up the phone, stop all the texting, pick up the phone and hear each other's voices um, at least 24 hours before, before you see each other. That way you can confirm where you're meeting and you know exactly what the other person sounds like. For some reason it just makes everyone feel less nervous. So, meeting up. This is a really good bit. So when you meet each other for the first time, make sure you smile. People forget to smile because they're so nervous. Smiling's really, really important. It just warms everybody up immediately and it's a very natural thing to do. Make sure you don't have a big dinner on the first date. Keep it short and sweet. So perhaps go for a walk, go for a drink, have a coffee. Don't have too much alcohol. That's a really big no-no. If you're going to drink, stick to just one drink. And you know, make sure you don't get drunk and you've not been drinking beforehand as well. Stay sober, it's really important, that one. So once you're there and you're together, be yourself. You know, you've joined each other to meet up, to have a date, just be your natural self. There's nothing worse than pretending to be someone else or putting on airs and graces or trying to fit into someone else's mold. If it's not going to work, it's not going to work. So be you, be natural and be relaxed. It's really important to keep your mobile phone switched off. Don't be tempted to look. If you're a girl and you're meeting someone in the evenings and you just need to check in with a friend so they know you're safe, then just say so. You know, there's nothing wrong. Guys, I'm sure you won't mind if a girl says, just want to, you know, let a friend know that I'm safe, I'm good, and then I can turn my phone off and relax and enjoy myself with you. So, once you're together, the things you can't talk about. Don't mention exes. Whatever you do, don't mention exes, past relationships, things that have gone wrong. Keep it positive, keep it light, keep it fun. Talk about holidays, talk about funny things that you've done. Ask questions and be attentive of each other. It's really important to show that you're interested in the other person and that you genuinely care. At the end of the day, this could turn out to be your life partner and you will always remember your first date. No pressure, guys and girls, but keep it light, keep it fun and just be you. Now, the other things to remember on a first date are make sure that you not only look good and feel good and you're being perfectly natural, but at the end of the date, if you're really happy and you want to see each other again, let the other person know. Be honest with each other. Say if you've really enjoyed each other's company, say thank you and you know, be polite. If someone's bought a drink or a meal, make sure you message them afterwards as well to say thank you and that you've got home safely. It's always a nice thing to do. Guys, be chivalrous. Open doors, let the lady sit down. Those things don't go unnoticed. And if it goes horribly, horribly wrong, you know what, just say, I've had a really nice time, but I think we both know this isn't going to go anywhere, but I've really enjoyed meeting you. Well, I hope that's good for you and happy dating and enjoy your first dates.